Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Cohn from the Cohn Eye Center in Maitland, Florida, and today we're going to talk about how to heal eyes after laser refractive surgery. Since the FDA approved laser refractive surgery in the mid-1990s, LASIK and PRK have become extremely popular in the U.S. These procedures remove nearsightedness, farsightedness, and astigmatism, and reduce one's need for glasses or contact lenses. In PRK, a machine known as an eczema laser is used to reshape the cornea, the front surface of the eye. This changes the way light is bent by the cornea and helps the patient see better. LASIK, a similar procedure, uses the same laser, but instead of lasering from the outer surface, the laser is applied underneath a flap of corneal tissue. The healing after LASIK is often fairly quick, as once the corneal flap is replaced at the end of surgery, the uh, surface of the eye is once again intact. This causes only minimal discomfort and allows for quick visual recovery. The best way for the patients to help themselves heal more quickly is to follow the doctor's instructions to the letter. Most surgeons will prescribe both an antibiotic drop to help prevent infection, as well as a steroid drop to decrease inflammation. Stay on these drops until the doctor tells you to discontinue them. Also use frequent lubricating drops as directed, as the cornea tends to heal more slowly when it's dry. Wearing sunglasses outside is important, as UV exposure may promote haze to form within the cornea. Patients may commonly experience glare, halos, blurred vision, gritty sensation, and tearing after LASIK. Most of these will improve significantly over the first few days. Because the corneal flap is not sutured into place, it is of the utmost importance that patients do not rub their eyes during the first week after LASIK. Some doctors have their patients wear a shield during the day or at least at bedtime to discourage eye rubbing. PRK laser is performed on patients with a cornea that is too thin to have a flap made out of their own natural tissue. Since PRK is done through the surface of the cornea, it leaves a round defect in the surface very much like a large scratch on the surface of the eye. Because of that, the surgeon must cover this with a bandaged contact lens that must be removed later. Healing from PRK is slower because you have to wait for the surface defect to heal before the vision improves. The most important pearls to help healing after any laser refractive surgery are keep the cornea well lubricated, avoid rubbing the eye, wear sunglasses, and please call your surgeon if you have any pain, discharge, or loss of vision. Regarding laser refractive surgery, I'm Dr. Richard Cohn.